So there's another medical technique that I want to I want us to actually learn about, and um, this is known as the Vasalva maneuver. All right, Vasalva maneuver. So in, in learning about the ma Vasalva maneuver, of course, we have pictures that will show you guys how to um, learn and uh, know how to do it. The next we'll be talking about the uses of the technique, we're talking about the procedure, talking about the physiological effect and what diagnostic uses. So uh, the technique for doing this, like ways for doing this is actually what is different, different though. All right. But you guys, you get to see the two ways that you can be able to use and do a Vasava maneuver. All right. So you can see this one. They say that you pinch your nose, they close your mouth. The like you breathe out forcefully, all right. So, this one, if you are doing this type of Vasava maneuver, you are trying to prevent palpitations, all right. But Vasava maneuver also has another way of doing it and, and other differences, okay. So, let's look at the uses. Uh, if you are doing a Vasava maneuver, you are trying to diagnose a heart condition or you are trying to treat what arrhythmias, and you are also trying to what access the cardiac function of the person okay so those are the uses then for the procedure you can see that this procedure is different from this one okay so here they say that the patient will sit down or lie down they will take a deep breath then they will exhale forcefully through a closed mouth and nostrils okay it's basically the same thing Okay, about, but this one is, the person is standing up. Why this one, the person is sitting or lying, okay? Now, they'll, they'll exhale forcefully through the nose. And that deep breath will take you for about 10 to 15 seconds. All right, okay. Or maybe they'll continue for 10 to 15 seconds. Then they'll, okay, they'll maintain the pressure, okay, between 40 to 60 milligrams mercury, okay? So here we have it that you take a breath and close your mouth. Now, Push out the breath and strain for about 15 to 20 seconds. Open mouth and breathe out. If the heart rate does not slow down, repeat. Okay? So what is the physiological effect for this? Uh, there's increased intrathoracic pressure because you actually close your mouth and all that. There's decreased venous return. There's reduced cardiac output. There's activation of barrel receptors. Okay? So when baroreceptors are activated, that's when to actually prevent these palpitations that we have here. All right. Diagnostic uses: you are trying to uh, diagnose if there's a heart block. You are trying to diagnose what supraventricular tachycardia, and um, you are trying to diagnose the function of the AV node. Okay. You are trying to do all of this. And therapeutic use. Um, it can convert supraventricular tachycardia to a normal sinus rhythm. It can terminate paroxysmal supraventricular tachycardia. Then it can reduce ventricular rate in atrial fibrillation. Okay, so this uh, Vasava maneuver actually has diagnostic uses and also therapeutic uses. Okay, it can help calm some problems in the body. So that's it for Vasava maneuver.